Today we're talking about a move that stirred up quite the conversation, the signing of Max Pacioretty to a professional tryout, PTO, by the Toronto Maple Leafs. First off, let's acknowledge Pacioretty's history. He's a name that carries weight, having seen success with the Montreal Canadiens and Vegas Golden Knights throughout the 2010s. However, we can't ignore the fact that over the past two seasons, Pacioretty has struggled to stay on the ice. Whether it's due to injury or age catching up with him, his performance has noticeably slowed down. Carolina gave him a chance two seasons ago, and he only played five games. Last season with the Capitals, he managed 47 games, but the numbers weren't exactly mind-blowing, four goals and 19 assists. It feels like we've seen this scenario play out before with the Leafs, bringing in veteran players like Marlowe, Thornton, Felino, Simmons, and Reeves. They come in with big names and high hopes, but at the end of the day, they rarely make a significant impact on the team's success. Before we go further, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on the latest Leafs news. And if you're enjoying the content so far, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, it really helps the channel grow. Back to the topic. What concerns me the most is that signing Pacioretty could take away opportunities from the younger talent on the roster. We've just re-signed Nick Robertson, a young player full of potential. We've seen prospects like Fraser Minton and Easton Cowan light it up in the prospect showdown. This should be their time to shine and prove what they can do in the big leagues. Why not use these first few games of the season as an opportunity to experiment and see if these young guys can handle the responsibility? So, while some fans might be excited about the prospect of adding a veteran like Pacioretty, I believe the Leafs would be better off focusing on their younger players. Should the Leafs take a chance on Pacioretty, or should they invest in their youth? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below.